I have always had a fetish for sharp items and knives and things that, that cut well. I'm Tom Veff and I design Veff serrations. Now I'd like to show you how simple it is to maintain those serrations. First thing I recommend is to take a black marking pen and blacken out the serration so that it is totally black. The VEF Sharp is a convenient 600 grit diamond sharpening system. It comes with a screw on handle. The VEF Sharp has six unique sizes that can be screwed on either of the ends of the rods, along with a flat surface for honing your flat edge of your knife. For those of you that don't have access to a VEF Sharp, there's another method that you can use. If you'll go to the hardware store and purchase wooden dowels, in various sizes. We have 3 8 half inch, and 5 8 You can also purchase 600, 800, or 1,000 grit wet or dry automotive sandpaper. So you would take that and cut the paper the length of your rod, which I recommend five or six inches, lay it tightly against the paper and roll it up, and then take and cut that, producing a piece of paper that fits the rod. Then I recommend that you use a simple contact cement applied both to the paper that you cut and the entire surface of the wooden dowel. Let both sides dry and then you start your dowel on the on the paper and it'll stick to the rod as you roll it up and you will end up with a sharpening rod that looks like this. At that point select the size of the VEF sharp that has the appropriate size diameter to fit the serration you're about to work on. Holding the knife firmly and, and tightly, place the VEF sharp in it and in a simple lightweight stroking motion, stroke that pattern until you remove ink from the serration. And you do that until you have it matched, a few strokes, not a lot of pressure, and it hones the serration. That will bring an edge up to the back, which we call kind of a feather edge on the back side. You flip it over and with the flat portion of the VEF sharp, just barely away from flat, just gently draw it across two or three strokes to remove the burr that was produced in the first part of the sharpening process. And that will create a cutting edge that is going to be totally and completely acceptable. Now this will enable you to come into those serrations the same way you did with the VEF sharp and hone that edge. One caution, I might add, do not go both directions when using these with the sandpaper on them. The backward stroke will cut through the paper and into the dowel and ruin your honing rod. So you would only go that direction when using these. And gently stroke through the serration, removing the ink so that you can see where the travel pattern is of the dowel. And you do that until you've raised a burr on the back side of the blade. Then you can use the same dowel not flat, but at a slight, slight angle, and simply draw it across that until that burr is gone and removed. That will leave you with a super keen cutting edge. Both the original VEF serrations and the VEF flat top serrations offer increased cutting ability, and the VEF flat top serrations are easier to manufacture and maintain. I think you'll find that this is a simple way to sharpen and maintain VEF serrations. When you go to make a cut in something like a heavy rope like this, they catch and snag and you have to end up sawing your way through the product. They're cut at about a 50 degree angle, which creates a point that starts the cut, feeds it into the hollow of the serration, and severs the material. 